Hello everyone, TPUK here with some more regrowth. Yes, it's regrowth time. And videos are still uploading slowly, so we'll just have to put up with that for now until things settle down, as read life is getting busy and of course these PC problems. I keep going on about it, but let's get on with the episode, shall we? Okay, so we're getting a bit low on power here, because I've been working on the AE2 stuff and I'm finding my power is <laughs> slowly running out and every time I turn this on it runs out really quickly. It lasts about five minutes and then it's gone. So we're gonna have to work on some additional power there. So I've been looking in the quest book and this one of the quest lines is called the Mean Green Machine. I was going to work on solar by here, but we'll go down this option because it seems to be the easiest option. And what's this one here? Um, yeah, it looks like we got some gases or something. I'll work on that later. So yeah, Lean Mean Green Machine. So we've got biogenerators and biofuel and the biofuel is quite easy to make really it's simply put in the crusher and we can put in melon seeds that's an interesting option let's see what doesn't tell me how much power it gives me but we've got sugarcane uh, bread bread all right so if we look at the options we can get four from potatoes. I think we'll look for the one that gives us the most. So looking at this, it might be pumpkins actually. Yeah, so if we throw pumpkins into the crusher, because we don't really use them for anything apart from lighting or whatever, and use that fuel in the biogenerator, maybe that will give us a bit more power to get things running in here. Yeah, that's an idea. So I'll probably have to make another farm area eventually for that. But for now, I'm just going to get the biogenerator up and running. Sounds good. Let's get on with it, shall we? Right. So let me get things together here and I'll be back in a moment. Okay, let's make a start, shall we? Let's check out how we make one of these guys. So, to make the biogenerator, we need some reinforced alloys, some osmium plates, some energy ta an energy tablet, and they are made like that. That's quite easy to make. I think I've got one of these already made in here. I've got two of them. How many do we need? Two of them. Uh, we need some steel casing. And I have been... I'm sure I've made some steel casing here somewhere. I really should connect this up to the A2 system as well. Get all this stuff put in there. I'll, I'll probably have to make some extra drives for that. Ah, there we go. One steel casing. Let's take them out of there because we're going to need them anyway. And what else do we need? some plates and a advanced control circuit to see so we need some steel plates i think i've got everything there i've got the iron chipsets so let's turn on the a2 system for now i've been keeping it turned off for now Ooh, the lag kicked in there let's turn that on hopefully we'll have enough power Okay, chipsets, I've got one of them, right? Right, okay. So we're going to need to make one of these first. Let's see, can I make these guys? I think I need three of them. And what else? Can I make that now? Okay, what am I missing? Um. Let's see circuit bolts. 
Okay, maybe it's not the best choice to use the crafting terminal. I should get one of these terminals down here already. Let's see, use. Okay, got one of them. Uh, we should have everything almost. It's just this one here. Oh, and we need to crush up some of that, don't we? So let's see, can I make that? Well, almost. I just need a another one of them, do I? Okay, no problem. Let's make another one of them. Dead easy, right. Now I want to make my sin. <laughs> Let's throw that back in there a second. Oh yeah, that's what I did wrong. One of them. And we need to crush up some biomatter. So let's grab some pumpkins. We'll grab about that many. Oh, and I need to connect up a robot to the farm and field to get the pumpkins as well, haven't I? So I better do that. What's that power doing? Alright, it's holding out so far. Oh, getting stuck by that. Let's see, what do I need to crush it, do I? Okay, let's crush that up. Spread that out a bit. Because this button spreads things out here. Makes everything even. But I'm keeping it individual because A2 crafting requires things there. So let me just grab the last one of these. I'll leave them there because the auto system will suck it out. So let's grab that again. Where is it? Okay. Now, can I make this now? Or am I short on something? Oh, we got it. There we go. One of them. I probably need more, but for now we'll just see how it turns out. So we'll throw the steel casing in there. Don't need that. Okay. Now let's grab some uh, pipes. Ooh. Really laggy. I'll have to work out why that is lagging out. Because it only does it every now and again. Okay, let's get this connected up to the system now. Let me see. We will need some of them. Okay. So for now, we'll just put it down under here. And it should provide us loads of power. I hope. I'm not sure how much power it gives me actually. Like the solar power generator up here gives me 38. So hopefully this will give me a bit more. Where should we put this anyway? Um, it's got to be on the top half of that, isn't it? Okay, we'll put it outside for now until I find a more permanent place to put it. Let's grab this out here. <laughs> God, that lag. And let's open that up. Because if I put it by here, I can connect it to the dense cable right by here, I think. That'd be an idea, wouldn't it? Maybe if I moved over one. Okay, let's put that right by there. Right. Well, the question is, we oh, we need output as well, don't we? So, <laughs> didn't think that through, did I? Um, yes, yeah, so we input. The, oh, no, no, I'm right. If we do this now and just throw in the things, it should work. So let's connect that up to that. Oops. Come on, give it back. Let's see. That. There we go, that's connected, because that's going on the input side of there. And mistakes we made there. Come on, give it back. Thank okay, you. So, here we go. Right. Oh, so that produces 280 RF. And if we put in... Where's the, where did that pumpkin go? I did have pumpkin on me, didn't I? That's strange. Let's see, where is the pumpkins? 
Oh, they could have sworn I put some in there. I'm going to grab some outside here. Let's throw in one for now just to see how much power it gives me. Okay. Getting confused. Biofuel, please. Whoa. Okay, throw them all in. <laughs> yeah, that's quite a bit of power, isn't it? Let's have a look. Yeah, and that's getting all used up by the A2 system. So let's uh let's turn that off a moment. Damn lag. And it's well, give me a good idea then of off, please. Gotta use that up quick, don't it? So we're definitely gonna need to farm up and find a sep area for this. Okay, it's night it seems to be more lag in night, so we'll have to light up the area outside, I think. So a bit of sleep there. Well, let's go and harvest some pumpkins from out here. Which should be right by here. Let's grab a load of these. They'd probably be used up within five seconds now. And it looks like we might have to put the larger capacity battery down as well. That's going to be 53, and that's going to be used up within 5 seconds that we watch. So let me just crush these guys down, which is this one here. I'm leaving things out there. There we go. And uh, they should get thrown into one of these chests now, I think. As if they turn the E2 system on, because when it's off, they stay here. Let's grab that many. We'll leave them run because I just want to see how quick this charges up. Let's have a look here. So we're currently at. How are we at zero? Hmm, that's strange. Maybe it's because it's, it's been sucked up by the A2 battery. Let's see. If we throw in these guys here. 64, ah, right, gives me 64 KOF, and that's how much is in there at the moment. It's not lasting quite a while, actually. So that's producing quite a bit, actually, I think. There we go, that's charging up now. Let's see what the battery's doing. Okay, let's check on the battery downstairs, because it's probably that one, isn't it? Okay, let's see how much power is getting thrown into here. So that's 400. So, looks like that's fully charged now, as soon as I get down here. And that's going up... Okay. 185. Uh, seems alright. I don't know if that's going to be quick enough for me. So, probably you have to make another one of those engines. Oh, well, actually, i got to turn in the quest. I think that gives me more. Let's have a little look again, shall we? So that's got biofuel stored there, which is producing us energy, and I can... Oh, there we go, producing, storing. Oh, why isn't it... offloading that energy then? That's strange. Like it should be... Oh, well that was a weird glitch then. I don't know what happened there. Yeah, it should be output in... to here, but for some reason it's not... It says, it, it says it's output in there. So let's have a little look here. Disabled. Reducing disabled. Let's try and mess around with this, see what happens. No. <laughs> disabled. Yeah, for some reason it's not draining the energy. Oh, no. Yeah, that's a mystery. 
Anyway, <laughs> we'll just have to put up with it for now. Let's go and grab the other pumpkins in here. Wow, we've got loads there. Might as well fill that tank up, I think. So we can work out what wiring issues are going on down here. So might as well just fill that up to capacity. There we go. So we got loads of biofuel now, and hopefully we'll have loads of energy. I can't really see why that's not working. But it's gone up pretty quick. So anyway, let's turn in our quest and grab ourselves a few more engines, shall we? Where is it? There it is. So we're going to get 64 biofuel. Oh, another four, is it? Nice. Cool. And let's see if that's opened up any other quests. Oh, I feel so silly. Do you know what I did wrong? Well, apparently the pipes were not connecting to these. Let's see. We've, got st we've still got stuff stored in there. And if I dismantle them, they still keep all the energy. So we've got all these guys here already. So the pipes go behind. Yeah, they go behind. So we'll have to uh, pop downstairs and put them back in position. Let me just cover up these holes here. Let's see now, did I get the blocks of me? So let's fix up all this bit here and I'll probably move these downstairs. Let's just cover that up in a minute. Pop down here. There we go. So we'll put this, say, by here for now. Because I'm expanding the A2 area over there. And I'm going to move all that further back and rearrange everything. So I've got this here just for now until I move it over there. So let me just get the pipes in position. So we went, say, come down. Yeah, and we'll put them right by there. That sounds good to me. Let's put that like that. There should be enough room for it to connect to here. Actually, we might leave them here. Okay, here we go. Ready for the power? Let's feel the power. Whoa, there it goes. <laughs> Make sure we got the right one here. Oh, I put the wrong one down, didn't I? Got to get the right one. Which one is it? That one and that one. There we go. What's that doing? Wow. Big difference, isn't it? So that's pumping out so much. 20. No, 40. 13, nice! And how much is going through there? You can't really see how much is going through the pipes. But it is working, and let's see how quick it goes through the fuel. Not too bad. And that's from a stack of 64. So that lasts me a little while anyway. Nice, so we've got a te temporary power for now, but we're going to need to get more power again. I think we're going to need lots and lots of power actually but that's really going like crazy. So let's see how that copes with the A2 system permanently turned on and we'll turn on the growth accelerator just to test it. So should be on. Yeah that's on. I saw a spark. So let's see how quickly that drains now. Oh, that's great, it's going up, not going down. That's just what we wanted. So we more than enough power there for now. Oops. But I don't want to have the growth accelerators permanently on. So we'll turn it off for now. And I want to set that up so that when the crafting system requires it, it turns itself on. I'll have to work out how to do that. 
Let's have a look what I've been expanding over here. So all this is going to be moved over this way a bit. And I've got the pipe along the back here. Because I'm going to have the pipe work on the top. Just to make things all neat and tidy. And we should be able to cram some more machines in here, hopefully. Uh, well, this is set up here nicely. Yeah, it looks good, doesn't it? So we've got power now, and I'm quite happy. God, that's going up quick, isn't it? Wow. <laughs> I'm really happy with that. So let me oh, get in there. And we probably wire up the other two as well. So let me just put them in position anyway. Why is lava going in there? Let's block that off a second. Don't want anything going in here, do we? Can I get it on there? There we go. Let's just stop any accidents from happening. Uh, we'll put the other one by there. I did one of these have some spare. Oh, I got some spare on me. So let's throw that in there. And we got even more biofuel in there. Cool. I think it's. I'm quite happy with that. Oops, fell down. Let's get back up and let's double check it out. And when it's full, the rest of the power should stay in here. And how much is that? Oh, there we go, 280, and if we look down here, yeah, let's store on that. Nice. Okay, we'll leave that run for a little while, and I'll be back in a moment, and we'll have a look at what we're going to do next. Okay, now that we've alleviated part of the power problem, for now, and at least, let's have a look at one of those quests I saw right next to here called image seeds and we'll probably work on some of these in another episode so what we got here is image seeds and they are used in another mod pack I think is academy craft so we'll probably do this so how do we do this I think we need a osmium seed and oh, we just put it in the metallurgic infuser and we need some diamond dust all right that's nice and easy okay let's grab some diamonds i'm not sure how many i'm gonna need so let's throw these guys in here just for now grab some of the dust and let's grab it for the a2 system grabs it. <laughs> I got three because it has been three before. Oh, one more, one more, one two. But, uh, okay, so let's get down there now. Hopefully, I haven't got any coal left in there. So look what we got in here. It's empty. Let's grab that steel dust that I've been producing. And let's put that in there, and one of them, two of them, two it is, right? No. Okay, how many do I require? Three? Four? Not even four. I don't even know how many I need for that. Okay, well, let's go and grab that dust anyway. So... Let's see, dust. Where's the diamond dust? Okay, it's nine there. I hope it's not going to be more than that. So let's see. Nope. Come on. So has it got to be a certain type? Osmium. Osmium. That's weird. Unless I've got to analyze it. 
Ah. So it's got to be a strength 10, is it? Looks like. Okay, we need a strength 10, by the looks of it. Uh, okay, let's see how powerful this one is. That's annoying. Let's see, now I was growing it that way around, so let's see. Analyze that. So strength 6. So strength 3. So let's test out if we do actually need a strength 10. It does look like it's... Let's throw them all in there. Yeah, I need strength 10, don't I? Okay, let me... Uh, let me have a look around, see what seeds I've got, and hopefully finish that off. Right, it turns out that I haven't quite got the right strength seeds, so it's still on 7, 10, 8. So what I think I'll do is I'll leave that grow to the next episode, and then we'll have a look at maybe a bit of academy craft, and we'll see how it goes. How quick is that growing anyway? It's going to take a little while, so we'll leave that for now. So yes, it's the end of the episode. So I hope you enjoy watching today, guys, and come back next time, and we'll start looking. Uh, maybe some academy craft.